So a way to make more money is to charge more. And there is a virtuous cycle involved in higher prices that is often overlooked. So often my clients think that if we raise prices, that will somehow be a negative for customers because they have to pay more. So that of course makes sense. But there also is a positive for customers, which is that you also now have a larger budget to deliver more to those customers. Let's say that you have costs to deliver a customer of 10K. And let's say that you price $20,000. Okay, now you have a 50% margin, right? So you're here with the price and then your costs are here. Okay, <clears throat> now you can lower prices for your customers all the way down to 10K, at which point you start losing money. So that means that you're gonna go out of business really quickly, right? With a lot of businesses that are fearful of raising prices, they think, well, if I raise prices to 30K or 40K or 50K or 100K, my customers are gonna leave. They're gonna hate me, they're not gonna like it and so forth, which might be true, but you have another card to play. You have another sort of ace up your sleeve. And that is, if you raise your prices to let's say 50K, and maybe you have a little bit of pricing power so you can do that. So you move it here. This doesn't have to stay put. You can also say, well, and I'm gonna deliver more. So now I'm gonna spend 20K delivering to my customers. That means that I will invest more in my development. I will now give a lot of free services. I will have better customer support. I will have better customer success, um, whatever it is that I need to do to justify the new and higher price. It's really hard to pinch your ways to save your ways, your, your way to a fortune, right? So if you save all your life and you, you know, you only buy secondhand clothes and you cook everything yourself and buy in Costco, whatever, you can become a millionaire, but it will take you 50 years and you won't enjoy the process. Another way to become a millionaire is to just deliver a lot of value to someone else and charge for it. And these two things are connected. If you deliver a lot of value and charge for it, that's what allows you to actually deliver a lot of value, right? So in another way, you could say that the price that you charge your customers become the budget you have in order to deliver value and to sell customers. So the virtuous cycle of pricing is that the more you charge, the bigger budget you have to then deliver more value and tell more people about it so that you get more customers. Sometimes I see that like SaaS businesses, they sort of, they, they, they starve themselves to death. They just charge so little for an otherwise pretty valuable product that, you know, they don't really have the cash flow or the profitability to invest more into that product and make it worth more or to develop a, let's say, healthy marketing or sales motion to tell more people about it which would get them more customers so that they could scale at higher prices and deliver even more value. So it's, it's, it's a critical balance to strike right when you're starting out with a SaaS business and your product isn't that good yet, when you should start to raise prices a little bit more aggressively to get a bigger budget to then get a better product. But it is something that you should start doing sooner or later because you cannot save yourself uh, to wealth. You have to invest yourself to wealth and the only way to invest is to ask customers for money so that you can invest on their behalf to deliver a better product. But once you get that mind shift, it actually becomes a service that you raise prices. It becomes something that you say, well, I know you don't wanna pay more, but you need to trust me that when I raise prices, I do it for the benefit of both of us. I do it for the benefit of me because I now get to build a better product which is more in line with how I want to serve you as my customer. That is why I'm raising the price. And essentially it's the only, let's say, deal or framework that, that really can, can carry both a higher price and a higher product in the same time. Okay, thank you.